Hi, boys and girls. I'm going to be sharing another story with you today called The Stray Dog by Mark Samant. And it is a true story that was originally by Rico Sassa. It is a Caldecott honored book and a really cute story. So apparently every book that Brienne and Jordan ever had related to dogs and cats because we obviously love animals in our house. So this story was chosen because um, when I was a little girl, my dad worked with a man who found um, some dogs that were on the side of the road, puppies that someone apparently no longer wanted. And they took the dogs in as strays and some of my dad's different co-workers adopted them. So when I was a little girl, I had a dog that was a stray dog and we named Spunky and he was the cutest little thing ever, little bad guy, but um, I loved him and we knew that we needed to give him a home. So this story is about a family that finds a stray and does the same thing. So let's enjoy the stray dog. It was a great day for a picnic. What's this? asked the father. It's a scruffy little dog, said the mother. He looks hungry, said the girl. I think he wants to play, said the boy. The children played with him and taught him to sit up. They named him Willie. They kept playing until it was time to go. So as you're listening to the story, think about some of the story elements. Think about some of the details. Let's take Willie home, said the children. No, said the father. He must belong to somebody, explained the mother, and they would miss him. On the way home, the girl said, maybe Willie doesn't belong to anybody. During the week, all the family had on their minds was Willie. So everybody's going about their business each day of the week, thinking and wondering whatever happened to Willie until the weekend comes and it's Saturday and the family's having a picnic again. What do you think will happen? Willie, they all cried when he appeared, but Willie didn't stop. He was in a big hurry. What's going on? What's happening to Willie? He has no collar. He has no leash, said the dog warden. This dog is a stray. He doesn't belong to anybody. The boy took off his belt. Here's his collar, he said. The girl took off her hair ribbon. Here's his leash, she said. His name is Willie and he belongs to us. So think about how the story is changing family is having a picnic. They find a stray worrying about him and now what's happened? They took Willie home and gave him a bath. And after that they introduced him to the neighborhood where he met some very interesting dogs. And Witty, Willie <laughs> settled in where he belonged.
and that is the end. So have any of you ever had a pet or know someone that had a pet that maybe someone didn't want or wasn't able to care for and you or your family or family members took them in? We actually had that happen just recently. Uh, Jordan has a hedgehog that he had a friend that was no longer able to care for her. So we now have a hedgehog in our house as well. So we'll make sure that you guys get a chance. Maybe I'll have her as part of the Zoom meeting tomorrow. You get a chance to see her. She's very cute. Her name is Peanut. Well, I hope everybody's having a wonderful day and I will be sharing some more stories. I'm actually going to upload this on our Google Classroom so that you can access it that way. And um, I hope you enjoy the story. I will see you guys later. Bye.